Hello, my name is Glenn Dyer, and you are watching a Dyer Situation. Today, I'm seeing Rock the Rock, Rock the Caspa, um, starring Bill Murray. Um, my neck is absorbing my head. Uh, I don't know. What do you want from me? This uh. The only thing I'm finding noteworthy about this is that it looks kind of similar to Ishtar. I haven't seen Ishtar, but I know of the I've seen the trailer and I know that it's somewhat of an in joke among filmmakers and stuff, but it looks kinda like that, like I think in that one it was like some comedians who went there. I don't know. I don't know the story of Ishtar. Just the trailer for Ishtar. And the trailer for Ishtar the trailer for Rook the Kospov reminded me of the trailer for Ishtar. And that's it. I don't know if they have any connection beyond that. But this is about, like, a musician going to the Middle East or something? I don't know. It looks weird. It looks like a Bill Murray 2010 flick. <laughs> uh... Yeah, what do you want? Well... So this movie, it's one of those ones that kind of just moves along at its own pace, uh, and does everything naturally, and it's really freaking good. Uh, did not expect it to be as good as that is, honestly. Um, jeez, but any movie that that I leave with a, that gives me a smile that big at the end of it. It's gotta be good. Okay, so, what it is, is basically, Bill Murray, um, he's a down on his luck agent, um, um, and here's from one guy that if he goes on a, like a USO tour, um, he can actually, uh, make some money, like touring Afghanistan and just giving shows for the army. Um, and, you know, shit goes wrong because Afghanistan. But, what I like about this movie is the subtlety of it. Uh, like, it spends a lot of time setting up environments and, you know, just the scenery and how horrible that place is before you really get into the characters that live there. And it helps, and it helps you understand them. It helps you emphasize with them when the time comes and you get really invested in it. Uh, and Bill Murray, of course, is playing a Bill Murray character. You get invested in him too. And towards the end, you feel like he can do almost anything, even though he can't. And it's a, it's a great experience. Um, definitely not expecting it to be as good as it was. Uh, and yeah, the end the ending of it was great, like five star great. Left left me grinning ear to ear. It was a great ending. Um, and not much more to say, not much more to complain or anything about. Uh, this is a pretty damn good movie. And until next time, I'm Glenn Dyer, and you have been watching A Dyer Situation.